Gallbladder is a small pouch-like organ found underneath the liver on the right side of the abdomen and it's part of biliary tract. Its primary function is to store and concentrate bile, a yellow-brown digestive enzyme produced by the liver. Bile is secreted by hepatocytes. When it required, it will be released into the intestine but most of the bile from liver enters the gallbladder, where it's stored. Bile inside of gallbladder is composed of water, which is 89%, and solid, 11%, which composed of organic substance like bile salt, which is synthesized by liver from cholesterol by help of cholesterol 7A hydroxylase enzyme, bilirubin which is yellow pigment derived from the breakdown of heme. Most of the bilirubin in bile is conjugated, which are water-soluble and stable, but a small proportion consists of unconjugated bilirubin and cholesterol, phospholipid, fatty acid, and inorganic substance including calcium, sodium, chlor. Most of the functions of bile are due to bile salts, including digestive function, absorptive function, and excretory functions. Bile pigments are the major excretory products of the bile. Other substances excreted in bile are heavy metals like copper and iron, some toxins, cholesterol, Goldstones occur when there is an imbalance in the chemical constituents of bile that result in precipitation of one or more of the components. There are two general classes of goldstones. Cholesterol stones contain more than 50% of crystalline cholesterol monohydrate and pigment stones composed predominantly of bilirubin calcium salts each with different risk factors. More than 70% of gallstones are composed primarily of cholesterol, either pure or mixed. Cholesterol is virtually insoluble in aqueous solution, but in bile, it's made soluble by association with bile salts and phospholipids. In the simplest sense, Cholesterol gallstones form when the cholesterol concentration in bile exceeds the ability of bile to hold it in solution, so that crystals form and grow as stones. Types of abnormalities that have been considered to be responsible for cholesterol gallstone formation is cholesterol supersaturation might occur via excessive cholesterol biosynthesis which is the main lithogenic mechanism in obese persons. Defective conversion of cholesterol to bile acids in the non-obese. Interruption of the enterohepatic circulation of bile acids. Hypomotility of the gallbladder. Stones composed largely of cholesterol are radiolucent. Sufficient calcium carbonate is found in 10 to 20% of cholesterol stones to render them radiopaque. Pigment gallstones are complex mixtures of insoluble calcium salts of unconjugated bilirubin and inorganic calcium salts. Chronic hemolytic anemia, severe ileal dysfunction, and bacterial contamination, especially of biliary tree like E. coli, increase unconjugated bilirubin and stone formation. Pigment gallstones are brown to black. In general, black pigment gallstones are found in sterile gallbladder and brown stones are found in infected large bell ducts. Approximately 50 to 75% of black stones are radiopaque due to calcium salts, while brown stones, which contain calcium soaps, are radiolucent. About 15% of gallstones are calcified enough to be seen on a plain abdominal radiograph, and of these, two-thirds are pigment stones. About the risk factors, first, 
middle aged female. Estrogen exposure, obesity, and rapid weight loss are also strongly associated with increased biliary cholesterol secretion. Gallbladder stasis. The majority of gallstones are asymptomatic, and only about 10% of those with gallstones develop clinical evidence of gallstone disease, which is usually manifest as either biliary pain or cholecystitis. If a gallstone becomes acutely impacted in the cystic duct, the patient will experience pain. The term biliary colic is a misnomer because the pain does not rhythmically increase and decrease in intensity. Typically, the pain occurs suddenly and persists for about 2 hours, and it usually felt in the epigastrium 70% of patients or right upper quadrant and radiate to the interscapular region or the tip of the right scapula which is called Collins sign and often follows a fatty meal that induces gallbladder contraction. Combinations of fatty food intolerance, dyspepsia and flatulence that not attributable to other causes have been referred to as gallstone dyspepsia. Patients with the lithogenic state or asymptomatic gallstones have no abnormal findings. But in cholecystitis, which is one of presentation of gallstone, there is right hypochondrial tenderness, rigidity worse on inspiration, morphous sign, fever is present, but rigors are unusual. Complication of gallstone is inflammation of the gallbladder, cholecystitis. More severe complications include inflammation of the biliary tree, cholangitis pancreatitis, empyema, and perforation. Ultrasound is the investigation of choice for diagnosing gallstones, and MRCP are excellent modalities for detecting complications of gallstones. Asymptomatic gallstones found incidentally should not be treated because the majority will never cause symptoms. Symptomatic gallstones are best treated surgically by laparoscopic cholecystectomy. Non-surgical methods may be tried if surgery is not an option.